Hello everyone. Today I want to talk about workmanship and the definition of workmanship is simply this, the degree of skill with which a product is made or a job done. And the Bible says in Ephesians 2.10, for we are his workmanship created in Christ Jesus for good works. Do you hear me there? For good works, which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. I'll tell you a story. I'm going, to go, I'm going to date myself because back in the 70s or late 60s, I should say, there was a game called knob hockey. And some of you older guys, you know exactly what that game is. And uh, that game was, you know, you had little hockey men and you would pull the knob and the, the little players would go back and forth on the, on the board. And, and it was a lot of fun. And I wanted one of those. So on Christmas Eve, it, you know, I got up really early because man, I got that game. And I, I knew enough to drag it into the kitchen to start playing it because I didn't want to wake everybody up. So I, I get the game, I start playing it in the kitchen, and then I noticed that one knob and rod wasn't right. It wasn't straight. It had a little catch in it. And uh, I had even named the guys. And because I wasn't to be the Red Wings, I, I remember the one guy that didn't work right, his name was Frank Mahovlich, and you can look that up. He played for the Red Wings uh, back then, and um, he just never worked right. But as I, pulled, as I looked at that game, I noticed something that has stuck with me because I looked in the box, and there was a little tag that said, inspected by, and I'll just use the number, Inspector 704, all right? And... Uh, I'll get back to that in just a second. But I had cousins, and they would come over, and we'd play for hours. And because I always wanted to be the Red Wings, uh, you know, I used the bad knob with Frank Mahovlich. And uh, when I lost, I would remember and want to blame Inspector 704. And, uh, you know, because I would always think, couldn't Inspector 704, couldn't he have done a better job inspecting the game? And, uh, and whoever made the game and the rod and the knob, that uh, couldn't they see that it wasn't right? And man, they're affecting my game, man. I'm losing to my cousin. You say, Dean, man, you sound passionate about that. You know, you're in your 60s. You should get over it. Yeah, I think I should. But whenever I read Ephesians chapter 2.10, just like that game, I remember that I am his workmanship and I was created for good works. I was made to work right. So then it always leads me to a prayer. And my prayer is this, Lord, I want to reflect your workmanship in my life. I want to do good works. Help me and forgive me when I fail. Because I sure don't want to be like that defective hockey game. God bless you.